Well, it's a program that started four years ago with a challenge from the Chicago mayor at the time. Would you hire some kids from City Colleges of Chicago to work at your blue chip company? Well, WGN's Julie Unruh has more on an ambitious apprentice program that started practically that day. That program started with five college students and just one company. Well, today, close to 50 businesses have hired roughly 1,000 apprentices. The end game here is to hire them permanently and give students without a four-year degree a shot at the corporate world. And if you ask the senior managing director at Accenture in Chicago, he'll tell you the program is working. This isn't a philanthropic program. You earn, you contribute, and you learn. Jim Coleman manages 6,000 people at Accenture's global management consulting firm, a giant in the industry. He runs the Chicago office. But he and Ahmad al a young man who arrived in the States only seven years ago, are on a first-name basis these days. Ahmad's a, a wonderful young man. Uh, he came to this country from Syria um, and came and knew no one. In 2017, Ahmad was attending Wilbur Wright College, one of the seven city colleges of Chicago, in search of a better life for him and his family. That's where he learned Accenture was hiring apprentices to help with internal duties like IT work, security, and coding. This was Ahmad's dream. He had landed in Chicago only three years earlier at the age of 20, along with his parents and his sister Lana. His ambition and drive to succeed got him an apprenticeship at Accenture and in the good graces with all those he worked with, especially Jim Coleman. He's an individual who gets the job done. The position got him out a paycheck, full-time benefits and a crack at a full-time job when the one-year program was over. And for sure it was a life-changing. Um, it was a turning point in my career. I mean, it inspired me to work harder than ever before. He was flourishing at Accenture. He was hired full time and has already been promoted twice. Now he's able to provide for his family, buying three cars over time, as well as a home that they live and work in together. During the pandemic, Ahmad can be found at his desk inside, working as a senior security analyst. I have in my mind that I just want to work hard and prove myself. And my parents always um, teach me, like, if you want to get something, and you will work for it, you will see the whole world like helping you to get it. In just a few years, Accenture's convinced dozens of other companies to hire apprentices too. Companies like Aon and Zurich North America, now a thousand apprentices to date, many of them first generation college students. And we think that that number um, equates to, you know, tens of millions, approaching $100 million of economic value for the city. Jim Coleman's proud of what the apprentice program stands for, soft and hard skills for both the company and the apprentices it's hired. I think we learn from the apprentices as much as they learn from us. It's opened our eyes to the fact that we can hire in different ways, we can look in different places for talent, we can drive more diversity into our organization, and, you know, that's a win for our company. A win for Ahmad, too, an ambassador for the program consisting of coaching, mentoring, and more support than he ever could have imagined just a few years ago in a city he didn't know with a language he didn't speak. Now Ahmad couldn't imagine being anywhere else. I really want to see myself as Accenture leadership. I want to kind of like make this opportunities even bigger for people like like me who's looking who has like who have like really potential and they want to work hard and give them the, the same tremendous support that I got I want to be like the second gen maybe Ahmad went on to get his four-year college degree at UIC but isn't stopping there he wants to further his education as for the program just head to our website for more information on how to sign up as a business looking to start an apprentice program or sign up as a student looking to embark on a new career Julie Unruh, WGN News. Well, coming up, we'll tell you.